Hi, Chet again, the author of the book Speen. And I just wanted to add a little or tell another story because I really like telling stories. Um, and th this story is about how I came to be okay with being me. And the, see, what, what happened was that uh, my wife at the time wanted me to take the trash out. And so I, in order to take the trash out, it was about, I don't know, half a mile up the road to get it out to the main road. And so the first thing I did was I went looking for the keys to the car so that I could bring the trash out. And I'm, I couldn't find my keys. And I don't know if you've ever lost your keys, but that's kind of a panic attack waiting to happen. And so I start, you know, I start pretty calm though, right? I'm just looking for my keys, looking for the common places that they would be and all of those things. And they didn't turn up. So I go digging a little deeper. And the next thing I'm doing is taking cushions off of the couch and uh, digging into the drawers and getting into all the stuff in the house, going from room to room. And I'm getting more and more upset because that's how I am. I get really upset sometimes. And I'm getting all wound up and angry that I can't find my keys. And so my wife says to me, she says, why don't you just carry the trash out to the road? Because at this point, she just wants me out of the house. And that wasn't what I wanted to hear. So I went into the kitchen and grabbed the trash bag there. Um, I wrapped my feet around the bottom of the trash barrel and pulled the bag out of the barrel. And as I was pulling, I pulled so hard that the air pressure in the barrel and the bag, it exploded. And there was garbage all over me and all over the kitchen and all over everything. And I looked down in between the coffee grounds and all the mess. And there were my keys. And I realized that if I wasn't like that, if I wasn't the kind of person that's wound up and all that, I would have thrown my keys away. And it's actually okay that I'm the way that I am. It's okay for me to be who I am and how I am. And uh, I, I really think that that's the process of falling in love with yourself. Thank you.